let's turn to some lighter news. The end of the world. <laughs> uh, the news is constantly full of potential causes, whether it's nuclear Armageddon or environmental destruction. <laughs> I told you, that bear is the new face of Earth Day. <laughs> but, but as we learned earlier this year, one news network has actually planned what they'll show during humanity's final moments. If this is ever on CNN, it means the world is coming to an end. It's called Turner Doomsday Video, something Ted Turner actually produced in the early days of CNN to air on Doomsday when the world's ending. The video restriction even says, quote, hold for release till end of the world confirmed. Oh, that's great, CNN. So you're gonna wait till the end of the world to actually confirm something. But, <laughs> but look, I'll admit, I will admit, I, I'm intrigued by this. I'm intrigued by the idea. So, so tell me, what is the last thing CNN wants all of us to see? it? A band playing a slow dirge? Although, to be fair, when the world ends, it would be comforting to look at any marching band and think, well, at least they'll all die too. <laughs> but if, just as a side note, if the music they were playing rings a bell, th there might be a reason for that. In the video, the armed forces marching bands play Nearer My God to Thee, oh, the hymn that, as legend has it, was played as the Titanic sang. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> That was not the music that played when the Titanic sank. This was. Yes. The last thing those drowning people heard was some sort of French-Canadian space mermaids. That's a fact. <laughs> That's a history fact. Look, if humanity's time on Earth is going to end, this cannot be the last thing we all see, because a doomsday video shouldn't just be sad, it should be celebratory. So, with that in mind, we've produced a new video <laughs> for the end of the world for CNN and anyone else to use. Please enjoy. Hello, I'm Martin Sheen. And I'm afraid if you're watching this, the end times are upon us. Whether because of war, disease, or a genetically modified dinosaur, our world is now only moments away from total annihilation. So, let's take these last few moments to celebrate the greatest things about humanity's time on Earth. We had a good run, didn't we? We harnessed fire, invented languages, and engineered transparent underwater tunnels simply because we felt like looking at shark tummies. We were the first species to evolve to walk on two legs, and then invented a way not to. But perhaps humanity's greatest achievement of all was our total domination of every other species. Nice try, lions. Unless, of course, we're all dying because lions evolved and conquered the human race, in which case, well played, lions. <laughs> now let's admit, humanity sometimes failed to live up to our potential, as evidenced by our blooper reel. Tragically, it seems our time together as a species is drawing short, and life on Earth is about to end. So before we all embrace whatever awaits us, I have something important to show you. It's a model of an old West saloon filled with cat bartenders and cat cowboys. In conclusion, don't be sad over what we're losing. Instead, think fondly of what we had 
So let's give thanks to peanut butter, to water slides, to the night sky, to the beetles and the pyramids, to that YouTube video of Kelsey Grammer falling off a stage. The UN interpreter. <laughs> we did things that few thought possible. We mastered the art of the yo-yo and had a cereal that was nothing but cookies. We invented the automobile and then invented an automobile that could drive over 20 other automobiles. We made backpacks that looked like animals and then had those same animals wear them. We set magnificently pointless world records. We mastered relative time and hammer time. We developed string theory and string cheese. And you know what else? We went to the moon. So now, before we're all vaporized or whatever awaits us, I think it's fitting that the last thing we all see is this sick basketball shot. We did. This is Martin Sheen. Over and out.